All right, it's time to continue on with some more Mass Effect 3. where we left off last time, so let's continue. That's odd. Why would they leave crates of red sand lying around like this? Maybe they had something more important going on. Not Darius. Prophet is the only thing that matters to him. Anything else can burn. should lead us to Talon territory. The terminal is active. Thank you, Commander. Oh. Oh, I see. Well, that's a little late now, but uh, I think I was supposed to have Arya in that lift. Yeah, I think there was something up there. Yeah, it's a little late now. Oh, maybe it isn't. Here we go. Never mind. Perfect. Okay, so what next? offline. There should be a control switch for the generator nearby. Oh, hello. I am doing all right. Uh, how's it going on your side? I guess that takes care of the generator. Looks like they were using this to observe the detainment centers. Mission report. We're almost done scouting this location. The surveillance drones indicate the, det the detention center. Try this one more time. The detention center is on par with the last one we hit. But something feels off with the control patterns that the display table is spinning out. I recommend another observation room before we try to extract the civilians. H. Hmm. Okay then. That tower is the Talon outpost we're heading for. Looks like the Talons are given as good as they get. Well, there's a battle going on. It's time to, uh, get going. Time, I am not going anywhere.
Huh. That's interesting. You destroy a generator and you just repair it just like that. Huh. Interesting. Well, that's what it is. Alright, you're not exactly holding up your end of the bargain. I know you I know you want to omega back, but you gotta do your fair share. think so. Take care of the wounded and scavenge what you can. I want us out of here ASAP. You heard the boss. Move it. Looks like we found the Talon leader. My, my. Nyrene, aren't you full of surprises? Arya, the deception was necessary. I needed to figure out what your plans were. The people on Omega depend on us. 
I couldn't risk compromising our operation. Not exactly standard procedures for a street gang. When Cerberus invaded, the Talons were a mess. I brought... new direction. The General's been hunting us ever since. Right now, he's attacking one of our outposts. That's where I need to be. We're done here, boss. Right. Aria, Commander Shepard, whatever you're here for, the answer's no. Kindly escort yourselves off Talon territory. We're here to help. We'll talk about it after we reach your outpost. That's a generous offer. Aria, does the Commander also speak for you? Not the way I would have put it, but that's the idea. All right, then. Come with me. You've improved your biotics since last I saw you. You noticed the biotic grenades? You always did like blowing things up, given half a chance. Welcome back. Oh, let's get this show on the road. Rampart Max incoming. This way. Yeah, thank you, Captain Obvious, for pointing that out to us. Get out of my way. Jeez.
hope you're not afraid of heights. Finally, a little recognition. Actually, Arya, I'm Target Alpha. Thermal scope. system's been compromised so many times it hardly knows up from down anymore. Nirene to base. Need an engineer at the catwalk's entrance. Door's jammed again. This may take a moment. You're not just using the catwalks as a secret passage to the base, are you? A long drop is the best way to get rid of unwanted guests around here. We'll be evacuating this location as soon as possible. Try not to interfere with my people's work. Intel just reported in. The group of civilians we managed to evac arrived safely at the other outpost. Also, routine sweeps reporting nothing new on the adjutant presence. Adjutants? Creatures created by Cerberus. They eviscerate their victims' DNA, converting them into more adjutants. Some kind of Reaper-based weapon. I fought them before they're a nightmare. It got worse after you left. Cerberus lost control of them. Those things tore apart the gangs, then attacked everyone in sight. If Cerberus hadn't found a way to contain them, the entire station would be infected by now. Keeping your people alive through that couldn't have been easy. I watched friends get turned into monsters. And I had to kill them. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have an outpost to defend. The adjutants really got under her skin.
Well, why don't games actually be evil? Well, they're far and few. I know in uh, Payday you pay, yeah, in the Payday games you pay, you play as a uh, criminal gang member of the Payday Squad. A thief, you're actually an anti-hero. I'm just trying to think. There's actually, there actually is a game where you actually get to play as an evil character. It's an old school DOS game called, I believe it's called Dungeon Keeper, where you actually rule the underworld and what you do is you pretty much create an army of evil creatures to fight off the good. Just reported into the That's just one example of where you get to play as a bad guy. Hey, Commander, I just wanted to say thank you. And it's very, and it's a fresh game in my opinion. So the old cliche, uh, oh, hero saves the world, hero saves the damsel in stress, yada yada, blah blah blah. Yeah, Dungeon Keeper is one of those few games where you get to actually play as a bad guy. I check it out. Word is the attack on the station was led by Arya and that she's on four now. Boss is heading off to investigate. Try to stay out of trouble while she's gone. And don't get caught. Our forces are tied down right now, so rescue options are limited. B2T. Back to trouble. Cerberus is backing off for now. Make sure the scouts keep an eye out for the next attack. You've done an excellent job, Nyrene. But I'll be taking over now. You know what happens to people who argue with me. And if I say no, you'll just kill me and take over? My people won't stand for that. Yes, they do seem nauseatingly loyal. Either way, I'll get what I want. Not this time. Oh, this is a t Well, this one's a tough decision here. Um, and, you, and you can only please one of them. Oh, boy. Well, Nyrene did decept me at one time, and, uh... Although Arya is not exactly the most trustworthy of people, at least, uh... At least I did get on her good side. Ah, but the question is, uh... Which of these two ladies should I piss off? Should I piss Nyrene, or should I piss off, uh, Arya? Let's see here. Arya, Nyrene. Nyrene, Arya. Hmm. This is a tough one here. You know, if I was Shepard, I'd be like, you know what, why don't you two just kill each other, you know? I'll take over Talon. Open your eyes. This is a war of attrition, and you're on the wrong side. You gotta piss off somebody here. You might be right. But the people of Omega are my priority. You take over one gang and you think you're ready to decide what's best for Omega? Nyrene, watch and learn. As. Everything's in place. The entire station's connected. People of Omega, I have returned. Cerberus believes they have beaten you. They believe they have you under control. They are gravely mistaken. You are the lawless of the galaxy. You cannot be beaten, and you will never be controlled. Be ready. Your chance to strike out against your oppressors is coming. Together, we will take Omega back! That's your plan? Throw civilians at Cerberus? Anything is better than being locked up like mindless animals waiting for slaughter. I know what you're up to, Arya. And I don't like it. That's another cat fight. I have civilians to evacuate. I'll deal with this later. All right, let's get these people ready to go. Now. What are you trying to do? Trying? The people of Omega, my people, love a good street fight. When it breaks loose, they'll be ready. Nyrene's code of ethics won't let her sit by if civilians are exposed. 
It's what you makes could. Me. You could go do that. Skyrim's like an evil character, but I must warn you, it's going to be a lot so more difficult. Looks like I'm not the only one who didn't but I think, um, I think what you're trying to get at earlier was, like, where your character is evil from the start. And I gave an example with, uh, My people and Dungeon I Keeper. The main doors. Got it. Well, because I mean, with games like Skyrim and the other Elder Scrolls games, you start off neutral. Yeah, I remember when I played as Skyrim, I was a vampire, and, uh, actually, actually, being a vampire wasn't that hard. It was just super annoying. Of course, being a werewolf wasn't exactly a picnic, either. I think if being a vampire in uh, Oblivion was oh, much more annoying. Commander Shepard, we need your help at the main doors. We're on our way. Thank you. Something else of value in here? Can I count these? What's real surprising is that, uh, you know, you know, Oblivion's already celebrating its 15th anniversary and Skyrim's already celebrating its 10th anniversary. Speaking of uh, being a vampire, one thing I find incredibly funny is if uh, if you visit vampires as a werewolf in Oblivion, they do, they really make fun of you. Like, oh yes, they can tell by that stench. Well, werewolves aren't exactly the most uh, hygienic of uh, creatures, are they? And therefore easy to manipulate. Pretty much word for word. She thinks she's playing you. Nothing new here. 
One thing, though. I maintain command over my people. This is not up for debate. Just have them ready. Oh, they'll be ready. We're almost there, Shepard. The Talons will be the frontline fodder, now we just need to bring down the force fields to clear the way to afterlife. Which will release Omega civilians. Cerberus will have a million fires to put out. In one fell swoop, we'll have the people in the Talons working for us. You handled Nyrene perfectly, and got us an army. She wears her weakness on her chest. It would take more effort to stop myself from exploiting it. Let's hope she's up to the task. You and I will have to keep her on point. Now, I'll be at the command console plotting our next move. discount at your store the last time I was here. Enlightened, I see. Cunningly, I have a plan to recoup my life. Well, I'm really not much for exploiting. I just like do things the old-fashioned way. And it's far more rewarding than to exploit unless you can do it in your favor. Without having to use third-party mods and such. Temptingly, if you find it and send me the coordinates, I will make it worth your while. It's not a priority, but I'll keep my eyes open. Appreciative. Upon success, I will give you a finder's fee for your trouble. I'll let you know. Courteously, have a nice day. Take a look at my kiosk if you want to buy anything. Located the source that's powering the Cerberus force fields. Yes, I see. Shepard, take a look at this. The general is siphoning power from one of my main reactors deep in the bowels of Omega's mines. Unfortunately, access is cut off by the force fields themselves. Not completely. There's an open route through that dark area, then up. Hmm. The processing plant for one of the mines. It's been powered down. No force fields blocking it. We infiltrate there, find our way through the mine, then take that elevator to the reactor's back door. Good eyes, Shepard. Let's go. Not without me. Arya, my patrol, corner in the perimeter. Please, you didn't catch me. We're yeah, Skyrim came out in 2011 on. Did get this, Arya probably one of the uh, more unusual marketing right? dates. 11, Return 11, 11. The Talons are ready. But if I'm sending my people into the breach, I want to make sure those force fields come down for good. So like it or not, you're stuck with me. It's almost as if you don't trust me. Or for those of you who are good with binary, exactly I believe that is 63. You. We're going to war together. I'll make sure we can rely on each other. Agreed, Commander. Glad one of you isn't on a power trip. Go wait by the med bay, Nyrene. We'll join you shortly. Shepard, I have last-minute orders to dole out. I'll meet you there, too. Scouts are ready to go. I've blocked enemy access to critical areas. The frontal assault should be less treacherous. They think they have us trapped in here. They're in for some 
Shepard, got a second? Now what does she want? I know time is short, but I was hoping we could talk. Alone. Arya will be joining us soon. Now may be our only chance. I'm not trying to undermine Arya. I know she has to be ruthless. Let her have revenge. I'm not doing this for me, and I'm not doing it for Arya or what we once had. It's for the people of Omega. Okay. I get it. See you in a bit. Someone has to be their voice in all this. Incredibly powerful forces are about to do battle, with them caught in the middle. I just hope, as we bring down those force fields and go to war, that you can keep the people in mind. What's your impression of Petrovsky? An adversary worthy of respect. And not just because he's shrewd. When I was starting to organize the Talons, he offered amnesty to anyone who set down their weapon. A few of my people surrendered, and he made good on his word. So he has a code. And, as near as I can tell, it doesn't exactly match the elusive man's. Are your people ready for the fight? You needn't worry about the Talons, Shepard. They were thieves and scoundrels once, but they serve with integrity now. We're fighting for a better world. I have to wonder if the same can be said for our Asari friend. I suppose we'll know soon enough. How did you get mixed up with Arya? I was happy in the Turian military, but when my biotic abilities started to manifest, my superiors saw fit to reallocate me. They practically locked me away. I couldn't use my skills to benefit my people, so I quit. I floated around the galaxy, looking for a new purpose. And you found your way here? More like I lost my way here. But then there was this beautiful, fierce creature who didn't let anyone define her. I'll admit, I was mesmerized. I wanted a little bit of that to rub off on me. How close were you two? The draw was undeniable. Her strengths mirrored my insecurities. Maybe deep down it was the same for her. My trying to be with her turned into trying to be her. Irene Kandros was vanishing. You seem like your own person to me. For all the drama between us? I'm grateful to Arya. She helped me remember who I am. It took a lot to break away from her. But I regret nothing. You're a veteran. Why are you so disturbed by these adjutants? I know fighting Reapers is old hat to you, Commander. But these... What they do to people? They could still be out there. And if they return... I don't want to even think about what would happen to Omega's people. The image of that drives me. And haunts me. What do you know about the Cerberus force fields? The technology comes from beyond the Omega-4 relay. Flesh disintegrates upon contact. The power required must be enormous. I fear that disrupting it could destabilize other systems on the station. I hope we'll proceed with care and certainty. I appreciate it, Nyree. We're heading out soon. I'll be ready.
doors on lockdown. Those are exactly what I needed. Thanks. processing plants. It's been powered down, so we'll have to pry open the door. I'll get it. Access to the mine should be on the far side. And the reactor is beyond that? According to the schematics, I ran Omega and Irene. I didn't work the mines myself. No. You had indentured servants for that. Spirits. Relax. They're all Cerberus. They've been ripped to shreds. I don't like this. dead it's a bloodbath I've got a bad feeling we shouldn't be quiet what's that sound an adjutant oh no the general must have locked this place down to keep it inside Elevator to the mines is through that door. It's deactivated. Then we need to power this place up. There should be a master circuit breaker somewhere. These pipes power the door. We should follow them. Maybe the adjutant doesn't like its odds. Don't kid yourself. I've seen one of those things take down a squad of soldiers.
When this is over, there'll be a lot of repairs to make. I hope you'll focus on the civilian areas first. You are relentless. That's one thing we have in common. Spirit! Unload on it. Narcan, wake up! to the door. the elevator again. Stay alert. All right, into the elevator. I'll see the door, just in case. On to the mines. the general sealed that area to keep the adjutants in along with some unlucky soldiers yes the creatures killed them but didn't turn them into more adjutants can't shake it something's off you're just spooked there's a rhythm to this place aria to cerberus if you'd stuck it out here maybe you'd feel it too whatever's in our way we'll deal with it Damn it. They shouldn't be straining like that. Cerberus must be working them hard. Access to the reactor is somewhere on the upper level. Let's find a way up there.
across. That's enough for that elevator. One way to go. Down. Looks like that goes under the conveyor belt. Bastards are running this place too hot. It'll burn out in a month. Stay focused. Welcome back. Yeah, to bring you up to date here, uh, we're taking the fight to Cerberus, and that's pretty much it. Head up. Other than that, you really haven't missed a whole lot. Oh yeah, Narian and Arya are at each other's throats. If that means anything. Know our target. Expect heavy reinforcements. Just stay focused and find the access point to the reactor.
Cerberus invaded here. Killed everyone. I'm sure your dead workers feel much better now. The elevator to the reactor is across the way. Are you grinning, Arya? We're almost there. When the force fields come down, this war finally begins. For some of us, it started months ago. That wasn't war, babe. That was just warm up. I commend you. Your plan of attack was impeccable. Looks like we were expected. More like Lord. I knew the reactor would be the hard target. I gave you no choice but this route. Why don't you do this in person, Petrovsky? Get your own hands dirty. I take no pleasure in any of this, Commander. You're the ones trying to start a war for the glory of Arya. But now it's over. This isn't over until your next of kin can't identify you. I love your bravado, but have the sense to know when you're beaten. You've been neutralized, and I can leave you there to rot. You might as well give up. Never. Arya, what are you thinking? I'm not going out like this. Arya, don't! <laughs> What the hell is she trying to do? What do you think she's trying to do, dude? Damn it, Arya, you're forcing my hand. I'll do it your way then. Irene, Max!
Battle stations, prepare for attack. Get the demolition crews into position. You okay? 
Lucky you came to your senses or I wouldn't be. Next time, keep your eyes on the prize, please. Shepard tried rerouting power to save innocent lives. It was the right thing. When are you going to learn? There are no innocents on Omega. You fought bravely against those mechs in there, Nyreen. Very impressive. But? Why can't you bring that same grit when adjutants attack? It's pathetic. You tense up at the mere mention of those abominations. Lay off. She just saved you. I'm trying to help her, Shepard. Call it tough love. The war's starting. I don't mean to miss it. She's never been big on thank yous. Getting reports. All force fields down. Civilians taking to the streets in droves. Cerberus pulling back. That won't last. The people don't have the training to go up against Cerberus front lines. They'll be wiped out. Civilian casualties can't be avoided. You'll have to accept this. Say what you will, Arya. I won't allow senseless deaths. Do what you can to protect them. Of course, Commander. Arya, right here. Report. My team is scouting the maintenance tunnels. We've encountered Cerberus forces escorting engineers. They're moving gear. Look to be sending explosives to the station's central support columns. Bray, engage. Delay them as long as you can. We're coming. detonate the main column. They'll cut off the way to afterlife. The Talon offensive will be stopped cold. So we split up? Yes. Nyreen, lead the frontal assault. Shepard and I will meet you in the markets after we've taken care of those bombs. Of course. But don't count on me building your memorials if you get yourselves killed. Don't get ahead of yourself. The only route to the central column is through the tunnels. Extend the dam in the control room. That should get us across. Let's go.
Excellent. Eric, found what you want. Sending you the coordinates now. Is that my couch? Get to the central column before Cerberus sets off those bombs. to go. are under control here. What's your situation? We're advancing to the Gozu district. Move forward. Keep that flight covered. Yes, boss.
We're holding our own, but Cerberus has started targeting the civilians. Reports of casualties are coming in from all sectors. Just get to the rendezvous point. That's all that matters. Not in my world. Nyrene out. So how exactly do we get to Afterlife from here? I'm thinking the straightforward approach for a change. Cerberus. How do you know? You see the town. Never mind. Like they bit off more than they could chew. We should get a move on. With the civilian population contained, we should be ready to initiate the next phase of the project on schedule. Before host conversion, we should begin the process of fusing the control implants to the subject's nervous systems. With the current success ratio, we project being able to surpass demand by 300%. The first generation adjutants have been transferred from the containment area and are being outfitted with the implants. The previous batches have been processed and moved to the storage area. We can now control when and where the adjutants convert their victims. Initial testing on various species provides ample proof the virus can adapt flawlessly, regardless of the host used. With the civilian population contained, we should be ready to initiate the next phase of the project on schedule. Before host conversion, we should begin the process of fusing the control implants to the subject's nervous systems. With the current success ratio, we project being able to surpass demand by 300%. Those idiots were experimenting on adjutants. That explains the ones we saw earlier. I have priority memo. Test adjutants have escaped. They are to be rounded up and transferred to Central HQ's holding area post haste. Damage is to be avoided at all costs under penalty of severe combat pay deductions. Extra security. The doors only open one at a time. Makes sense, considering what they had locked up in here. Doors unlocked. Let's get out of here. That doorway leads to the Gozu district.
This looks familiar. I liked it better when Morden Solis was here shooting up looters. Speaking of Morden, I wonder if he's gonna be around. Take out the turret. That dude again, the mad prophet. He was in the first game, and now he's back again. Lovely. Irene here. Something's not right. Cerberus is still on my station. Of course, something's not right. Not what I was talking about. I'm checking this out. Going radio silent. What the hell is she doing? Where's Nyreen? Scouting ahead. We've got our hands full holding this area. She's going on to afterlife. Ah yes, Afterlife, the old club where we first met uh, Aria. Dies. Now. 
Irene Candros was a good soldier. It's a shame she had to die for your petty ambitions. You're a dead man! No, wait! What now, Petrovsky? Divide and conquer, Commander. Kandros killed the adjutants we hadn't finished experimenting on. These are fully under our control. The prototypes for our future army. Hold the perimeter! Keep Shepard away from those generators! Shield on me, then destroy it. Gotcha. You can't stop me so
Alright, that wasn't so hard. Shepherd, I surrender myself into your custody. That is the most pathetic thing I've ever heard. Shepherd, I'm unarmed, and I can give the Alliance intel on the elusive man. You'll say anything to save your skin. I let you escape, Omega. I deserve mercy. Is this true, Arya? Inexplicably. I think he'd agree now that it was the biggest mistake of his life. But this is murder. That's right. Cold. I'm not gonna let this one go. Murder. No less than you deserve. Oh, no. Not yet. You don't get a quick, easy death. Clean up this mess. Well, that was deeply satisfying. I'm a little surprised. I thought you might try to interfere. Why is that? This partnership has been an exercise in frustration. We won. Yes, I know. But I like to know what makes people tick. Especially someone I might need something from in the future. So come clean. Have you been trying to work me? Validating me one minute, judging me the next? Which is it, really? Have I been that hard to read? I've lived for a thousand years, Shepard, and you may be the most powerful and baffling being I've ever encountered. I have no idea where I stand with you. I like it better that you don't know. I'd hate to see you get too comfortable. You are a truly dangerous person. And don't worry, I honor my debts. You'll have all the troops, ships, and Izo that I promised. Then I'll be going. Bray will take you back. I have a station to whip into shape. Citizens of Omega, hear me. I, Arya Talok, have given you back your lives. My rule is reignited. My hand is on the controls once more, and I will not let go again. Each of you owes a debt. Gain my favor by rounding up the remaining Cerberus invaders, and... ...we will take our revenge. It's their turn to tremble. Their turn to bleed. Going forward, your lives will be hard. But the price you pay is for your freedom. Only I can protect that. And hear this. I will make Omega impenetrable. No one will ever threaten my domain again. From this day on, the galaxy will know one hard truth. Don't fuck with Omega. You always get these crap details, Bray? <laughs> Not this time. You got a galaxy to save. Let's get you off this rock. Ooh, that was quite a trip. 
Where next? So, looks like the Reapers are close by. Nothing. That's weird. It's supposed to be here, but I don't see him anywhere. Signal confirmed. Oh, what do we have here? Ooh, a hidden planet. Garneau is not located in this system. All right, well. Well, we tried. So he's not here. All right, well. Hey, you got an A for effort, though, so. Let's not beat around the bush. Reapers are on their way. It's very nice. Well, let's get out of here. Actually, let's go to the server slab instead. Since we're on task of taking down servers anyway, so let's go to one of their labs. Alright, we're out of town's way here, so. Signal confirmed. Oh, what do we have here? Oh, but the Reapers are on their way, too. Oops. Not what I wanted. Okay, 
Yeah, I don't think there's anything else here. Yeah, I don't think there's anything else. You always have to look for spots you least likely expect. That's the key to uh, finding things. Oh, it just uh, pisses off the uh, Reapers more. There it is. Go ahead and land. I've got a hail from Admiral Hackett. Put him through, Lieutenant. Shepard, we've uncovered a secret Cerberus lab. Function unknown. We sent in a recon team, but they were forced to pull out before they got very far. Any other intel? We think they're using the facility to warehouse and study Reaper tech. We've been wondering how Service is connected to the Reapers, and this might give us some answers. We're on it. Find out what Service is doing and get me any Reaper tech samples you can, Commander. Hack it out. my way.
will only lead to Metagel advances for Hannah. Only Cerberus would call that a failure. This is very interesting. If I can't do it, I'm not gonna waste my time with it. Need to hold out until Cortez can pick us up. Give me a chance to kill more Cerberus. Stay tight. This could get rough. Come some more of them. Stay focused. This isn't over yet. I'm with you. Keep the landing pad clear. Commander had to go dark side to shake him. Coming in hot, be ready. Heading for extraction point now. Extraction point. Ready for pickup. Not 
about time he came back. Whew. Okay. That wasn't too bad. Commander, we've got our best engineers looking at the Reaper tech you secured from that lab. What was Cerberus doing with it? We don't know yet, but whatever Cerberus is up to, it can't be good. Even if we can't determine its purpose, we've disrupted their experiments. I doubt they'll just close up shop. Agreed. We'll keep sending strikes against the facility. Good work, Commander. All right. All right, I think that's gonna do it for right now. All right, thanks to those who watched. Thanks to those who joined me in chat. I will see you all next time.